Hello everyone, welcome back to Hexen. It's been a few days since I played, but we have spawned in a cave. Where are we? We are in Tradictus' tomb. Oh, bad guys already. Hopefully we can get away with just shooting these things without aggroing anything over there, or maybe we go here first. Ah, okay, that's the way home. It's quite nice, I mean, at least there's a way to run. There's a way to run. The types of these servants have been getting some decent comments from some people just telling me about, you know, some, uh, some curios about the game or some tips. Obviously, everyone, apart from me, in the whole world, you, you couldn't get out of the room with the second piece of the axe key room. Uh, <laughs> but also, that there was a bug there. But, wow, that was actually a really good shot. I genuinely thought I was safe, but I was say it ain't so. I'm trying to hit any of these things, but the ground's in the way. One of the more interesting things I found out about this game is that these uh, green and brown serpents are identical. Uh, there's two types that fire these poison things. And then there's also the type that gets the, uh, the first level. Well, the second level. The first level. The second level is going to fire those. I suppose they're fire. They seem to be perfectly capable of doing it, so... That seems like a good idea. Look him down. Go for the aggressive stuff. Grab some wings, people. Let's spot that there was some down here. Ah! I was trying to scroll to this, uh, mystic urn here. Can I press... Oh, if I press E, by the way, if you don't want to fire as soon as you start... Um, pressing it. Well, let's find out if we should have. There is a mystic urn here, so I was thinking maybe I should just use that. Instead of... I was on my HP. Good idea. Didn't work. Yeah, that's actually where the stairs are. Oh, hell. Hello. I'm going to wait back. I assume we're going to have to go and beat Traductus. Presumably, my own master. Presumably means that I'm going to be being attacked by the. Um, It looks like it would go underneath, but of course it's a, a Doom-based game, so that's never going to happen. <coughs> Nothing there. <coughs> probably, should do. probably shouldn't waste the mana. But we should probably use not, not number four. Don't forget we have several craters of might available to us. Hiding in there, I guess. Thereby, I have a secret that I could uh, take advantage of. Maybe there's something in there like a mystery. The reason I couldn't get to this place is where that half is going to fight actually hit me, but uh, it's scary nevertheless. <laughs> segment of Wraith Bridge, which was actually pretty well timed. Hey. Just... I know. Help. Uh, we might be able to get But it was actually extra mana meat. Does not help. What are you saying? It does not help. It certainly helps. You know, in your brain, sort of, you can't decide which of two things to say, but they're opposites. I mean, they mean the same thing, but they're phrased in opposing ways. It's pretty easy to human brain to themselves. So, 
like the creature of night. So at least have a little bit of time to get out of the way. Scroll to it. So, there's so many items in here. It is a little bit ridiculous. Why don't we... <coughs> to jump over that. Uh, why don't we try using our icon of the defender? Because it makes us impervious to all damage. And uh, gives us no click for enemies. How many shots are you taking? Seriously. Have some decorum. <coughs> now I'm going to assume that every single one of these has a thing in it. It's a pretty cool one. I like the shape of this place. Hey, it's also like the shape of the thing in the original. Oh god. That's happening again. Excuse me. I will just close it. <laughs> Be gone. Uh, it looks like the shape of the thing that we <coughs> <I'm scared. laughs> originally uh, stepped on back in uh, chapter one. Uh, when our uh, went dark and solved the puzzle by stepping on an approximately this shaped pedestal. I'm very scared because I'm expecting at any point. These things will open and all hell will break loose. But this has not happened so far, so. In the interest of not putting any cuts in it, I'm just gonna do that. <coughs> more, uh, more, uh, mana for me. Uh, it's pretty obvious that that's gonna happen. This second hand is doing way more damage to everyone. I'm starting to think that the third weapon is literally useless. Okay, so I guess we'll pull two of these. The three of these, I should say. Uh, and that should open up two, at which point we scroll to this. Prepare ourselves to use it. Try and figure out how exactly we're going to do this. That looks like me. Yeah, that seems to go really well. Um, I was completely expecting that to be the worst thing in the world. But it turned out that I've got some time Get this out, use that. Get this out, use that. While we still have the uh, item of defender out, seems like a really good idea. That's interesting. Oh, what? Let's go back into that. It's <laughs> not where we want to be right now. He did pick up the holy relic. Uh, and we are no longer injured. We are once again losing. Let's open a thing. I mean. I assume it means conquer, right? Because winking, V I N C I T, uh, means. Well, wink airy. Here, okay. I knew they were there. I just failed to understand how they were. 
power pack. I don't think that they do. Jump out of them. This game does tend to uh, confuse me with uh, tropes. It never does what I expect it to do. Occasionally it does. But those are the, as I was saying, uh, intern players. <laughs> okay, we've actually succeeded at this level without horribly ruining ourselves to death. We should go back up here. That was actually a lot easier. Maybe using the icon of the defender would have been a good idea in the past as well. But at the same time, this whole level seemed that slightly easier. I should make sure I've got my crystal uh, quartz flasks on. My hot bar. Right. All three of these things. So now we have to get back out there. We do have two craters of light left. That is not many. Not many at all. So... The reason it worries me is that there are so many of these ghosty things out in this world that I'm using a heck of a lot of Wraith Verge mana, or mana from Wraith Verge, just to get through this. Mana there. But hopefully we don't get too many of those things showing up whilst we do this. I think I would have liked it if it maybe didn't make that noise. Just go in. Oh, I remember this. How cool is that? That's the same trick as they used in the um, swamp. By not having textures on the sides, they blend together. It's really cool. Very interesting. Right, this is the uh, thorax thing, so this could be the last episode. This really could be the last episode. We've got Craters of Might. We've got. Quartz flask. We've got switches that I refuse to pull on principle. There he is there. Oh god. So, we start off with the icon of the defender. It's going to take a few goes to figure out how to do it. Our crate is quite right. So, this is certainly going to be doable, I think. Having saved all these icons from the defender, I can't send the defender. I think we might have ourselves uh, a decent chance of beating them. So these um, just disappear every now and then, which is quite frustrating. We should pull these just because I can. There you go. Uh, oh god, he's run out! It's our use of it. I assume the goal here is just to continue to destroy these with great Now, of course, we don't have any items to defend them. We should avoid using uh, killing them until we've been in here and make sure we've picked everything up. Because we don't want to be trapped by unable to uh, get in out of here. Oh, fuck. Try not to step on those. There's quite obviously those. Um, Spice the music several times. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I don't want to be. You know, I don't want to find myself in a position where they're doing things. Oh, jeez. I want to make sure that we know how to get between our crater of light and our. What's the last one? I'm hoping that somehow I can get the. Uh, Crushes to do some damage for them. Maybe they get some final break for this one. 
want to be able to get between our quartz flasks and our scroll up, scroll down. It's dead easy. It's also really hard. Okay, we have 200 of all mana because they prepared us for this fight. What do these do? I know not. Is this doing anything? Ooh, that produces mana. Interesting. I don't have much of an opportunity to use that right now. I will scroll up to get to Crater of Mana. I think early on we don't want to use our uh, icon of the Defender to get to this face. This, this face seems pretty easy to avoid. Style. 
okay on green mana, but green mana's going to run out pretty quickly. How is this Dark Server? Wow, that was actually pretty easy. Don't mean to boast, but uh, it was that easy. I'm best. This was actually easier than the graveyard that led up to it, quite frankly. The only thing that made this remotely difficult was the awkwardness of the inventory system in this game. So you can kill these for Man, they don't even get achievements in games in Titan 95. You think they'd build them back in? Retrofit them. Uh, this all seems good. Well, let's finish this game. Yeah, with a scream of agony, okay, you are wrenched from this world into another. Every part of your body wreathed in mystic fire. Whoa. When your vision clears, you find yourself standing in a great hall filled with ghostly echoes and menacing shadows. Whoa, I'm scared. <laughs> In the distance you can see a raised dais, and upon it the only source of light in this world. In this world? Okie dokie then. Guess we'll see what that becomes. This can only be the Chaos Sphere, the source of Korax's power, who is now dead, so he's not that good. With this you can create worlds, or destroy them. By rights of battle and conquest, it is yours. Mine! And with trembling hands you reach to grasp it. Perhaps now, a new player will join the cosmic game of power. <laughs> like the pawn who is promoted to a queen, suddenly the fairy reaches the pawn to the individual class. Crescendo music. <laughs> Pictures. Hey look, that's me. But there are other players. Mightier than you, and who can know, and who can know their next moves? Question mark. I know it's all up in the air. Who knows what is going to happen next? Now, 42% gamer has told me that there are add-ons. So I'll say sequels, but not sequel sequels, like extensions to this game. There's another episode. There's a whole bunch more stuff. I'll see if I can get my hands on them. But for now, that is it. This is the end of Hexen. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate all the comments, all the uh, kind words you've given me, all the advice, all the information that I have just imparted to the next generation of people who will never know what it was like not to play games with the mouse and keyboard, not to have looking up and down, you know, it's just this wonderful game of, th this Origins game, this is the, one of the first games I ever played, and I have played it again right the way through. I have beaten it fair and bloody square, not a single cheat. Thank you everybody for watching and who knows what the next series will be, but no doubt it will be a doozy, so keep your eyes peeled and we'll see what that turns out to be. Again, thank you for watching and I'll see you then.